queens welcome back to my channel i know it's been a long while long time long forever i've been extremely busy based on the title this video is gonna be on how to do your goddess braids or gypsy braids i think it's popularly called goddess braids so as you can see i start by brushing up the hair of course and for this hair, I'll be using Ultra and Q Weave and also an Ankle V Body Wave Curl. So this is my first time using Ultra in a very long time, to be sincere. And it's because it's lighter than the normal expression. But I think the next time I might do this, I will use expression because I just like expression better. <laughs> so of course, I start with brushing up the hair with my M Pro Signy Jam. And I'm gonna use the Knotless method. I have a video already on how to achieve the knotless braids so you guys can check that out for more details. So as you can see I'm just parting up the hair and then clipping up the rest so it doesn't get in my way. And of course using my pattern comb known as a <laughs> And of course like I said I'm doing a knotless method. And again, if you guys want to see it more detailed, you can check out my knotless video that I have already on my channel. So I start with the ultra braiding hair first. And just when I'm about to get midway, I use the Q um, wet and wavy hair. So as you can see, I'm adding it in the invisible way I also have another video on my notice um, video that shows how I add this in a more detailed way and I just let it go like I don't break down with it I let it out and I continuously break down with the ultra hair and this is when I realized that I do not <laughs> like this hair because it's not curly at all <laughs> it said wet and wavy and nothing is waving so <laughs> And at the very, very, very end, I'm adding the end call V body wave hair because that's going to be the tip of the hair. So as you can see, this is what the first braids looks like. So what I did when I didn't know the camera didn't cut this, I glued the tip and then I cut off the cute leftover hair. As you guys can see that's what the bottom like the tip of the hair looks like it has the encore encore lovely body wave hair so here we are at the very top <laughs> you guys I always have the same structure for all my box braids so if you guys take a look at my box braids the Bobby no locks hair I did is always the same structure so that's why I've just fast forwarded to the very tip and what I'm doing now is just trying to lift some like baby hair, actual baby hair, not actual hair. She has a lot of baby hairs. And I stopped using the wet and wavy because I just didn't like it. It wasn't credit for me. So I started using the encore all through for the middle and the end curls. And also, I only use one pack of the um, encore because you don't really need a lot of pack because you're only taking like a little tiny strip of the hair. So you don't really need too much. So one pack should be enough. And another thing, if you want it longer and also want to use the ultra, you don't have to cut it because I cut the ultra hair so I can just braid throughout with the ultra hair without cutting it first. That way it will make it longer. So this is what I was talking about that after I put the glue, I just cut off the rest of the ultra hair and then I'll do a slight trim. And we're here for the mousse and you know, hairspray. And this video is not complete without me saying something that cracks up to later. <laughs> so here we are with the mousse. This hair do not need hot water simply because of the weave. And you want to make sure you get human weave because synthetic 
it will not last long at all so get like you can get like a nice cheap human weave hair for it of course so once again this hair does not need hot water so just mousse and hairspray and you're good to go so hair just working on them baby hairs like edges making them slayed because it was slayed And voila, goddess braids. You see the, you see the curls popping? Yes, the, the end curl of the curl is popping. And like I said, next time I'm gonna do this because this is my first time doing it this way. I'm definitely gonna use expression and just make sure I don't take too much portion of the hair when braiding. So as you can see, it's short and I wish it was longer. So hence why I said next time, if you guys want to also try this, you don't have to cut the ultra hair. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe.